Well, Christina Maurice, as you can see, it's quiet now, but it was almost like a Western showdown here on this field in Prospect Park. NYPD officers, they spent hours chasing after that bull before finally capturing him here in this baseball dugout. Mooing and running rambunctiously, this young bull making itself right at home in the heart of Brooklyn. It's crazy. This is bizarre. Spectators flocking around noon, hoping to get a glimpse of the farm animal in their urban backyard. My friend texted me like, you have to go down the street, like on the news, there's a cow outside. And I was like, are you serious? So I ran out here and there's all these people and this is hilarious and amazing. Literally the first time ever, I've never experienced anything like this. This is a total culture shock right now. For hours, he wandered wildly through city streets. Sources say he even rammed into a mother and child who were walking on Parkside Avenue. Witnesses tell us the one-year-old was knocked over getting a black eye. The mom was just crying. The baby was screaming in pain. It was scary, and I had my son with me, too. The toddler is expected to be okay after being rushed to Maimonides Medical Center with minor injuries. Meanwhile, the bull continued on its way, eventually ending up at this Caton Avenue athletic field near Stratford Road. Away from the fence! Several NYPD units attempted to corner him while controlling the crowd. Officers were eventually able to dart him with tranquilizer, fencing him into the baseball dugout before lassoing and wrangling him into an NYPD mounted unit truck. The determined animal apparently in search of greener pastures. <laughs> Sources telling us he came from a slaughterhouse in Sunset Park about two miles away. Maybe we should just let him be. We should just let him chill here. He can be our new, like, you know, park zoo. Well, the bull could not stay here, but he is now, we're told, with a New Jersey animal rescuer who is currently getting him checked out at a vet to make sure he is all good to go and healthy before sending him to a local farm there with other animals. We're live in Prospect Park, Reno Roy, CBS 2 News.